Samson and welcome back to Kids World Fantasy. In today's video, I will be telling you a wonderful story about Chicky Nicky. Once upon a time, there lived a small chicken named Chicky Nicky. She disliked herself because of her size. She was very small and her friends were big. Her friends sometimes used to tease her, saying that she was way too small for anything. Chicky Nikki disliked herself. One day, she was pecking some food from the ground. That's when something hit on her head. She looked up and she didn't see anything. So she thought, what could this thing be? And then she found out. The sky could be falling down, and she was scared. But really, do you think the sky can fall down? It can't. But let's see what what Chicky Nikki did. So she thought the sky was falling down, right? And she wanted to inform the king. So she started running as fast as she could. As she was running, she saw her two friends, Hini Mini, and Cookie Dookie. They were both chickens too. They asked Chicky Nikki, What's the rush? Why are you running so fast? Where are you going? Chicky Nikki said, The sky will fall down any minute. You need to come as fast as possible and let's go and inform the king. The three of them started running and running and running and that's when they met Turkey Lou and Goosey Poo. So that's a turkey and that's a goose. They both asked, what's the problem? Kini Mini, Cookie Dookie and Chicky Nikki explained everything. Chicky Nikki and the rest started running as fast as possible to go to the king. That's when they saw a fox. The fox said, my name is Foxy Lox. Foxes are really cr clever, you know that? So, Chicky Nikki said, Oh, okay, nice to meet you. We need to go as fast as possible. We are going to the king to tell him that the sky may fall down any minute. Foxy Lox got an idea. So now he wants to go to the king, right? Well, let me trap them. Foxy Lox told them, Oh, you want to go to the king? Just wait. I know a shortcut. Since there's a long way to go to the king, why don't you just follow me? Everyone, like fools, followed Foxy Lox. And instead of taking them to the king's palace, Foxy Lox took them to his cave. And there was no way anyone could escape. Now you know what the fox must have done. Well, he started eating up everyone. And he ate everyone up. Except for Chicky Nikki. How did she escape? Well, the fox wouldn't say, okay, you sit there, you can go and just eat the others. Well, Chicky Nikki is very small, right? So she spotted a small hole in the cave. Since she was very small, she could run through it and she forgot about the sky falling down and she was happy to be small. Why? Because she could rescue herself. Now, the moral of this story is that you should be happy with who you are, with what you are. If you're small, you're small. If you're big, you're big. Click to the left to subscribe and to the right to watch other videos in my channel.